Hey guys, it's Jane here with what's in my travel makeup bag. If you're watching this right now, I'm in Disney World currently. This video is pre-filmed, so this is everything that I took with me. I do tend to overpack a lot, even makeup, so I have a lot of stuff to show you guys, and I'm basically not going to go in any specific order. I'm just going to pick up and show you guys, because i got to get going. So the first thing I have is my blush that I'm taking. I wanted to take my e.l.f. duo, but it's just too big, it's too bulky, so I decided to take just a single e.l.f. Um, blush, and this is in Tickled Pink, which is just a really nice, everyday pink color. I figured this would be perfect for down there. Just like a nice shade of pink. Then I have my two concealers. The first one I use every day is the Maybelline Corrector Cover Stick and this is in green which corrects redness. It's basically almost gone so I need to get a new one when we get back. But it's just a green concealer. And then also for my regular concealer I use the Hard Candy Glamouflage. I'm in the shade light obviously. Look at my skin color. Um, I've had this for about six months and literally it looks like fully it's completely full, basically. So, um, I'm taking that with me as well. I'm also taking my favorite foundation, which is the Revlon Color Stay. I'm not, I decided not to take a tinted moisturizer because I tend to like foundation a lot better. So, and I've been breaking out lately. So, I decided to take my Revlon Color Stay. This is for combination oily skin, in case you're interested. And I'm in the color 220, which is natural beige. Then I'm taking my NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Yogurt, which is my everyday eyeshadow pencil that I use. It's just, I said eyeshadow weird. It's just a creamy champagne color that I use every day as kind of a base. Then I'm taking my moisturizer. This is the Jergens Natural Glow Healthy Complexion Daily Facial Moisturizer. Um, I don't necessarily like this. I have another one that's completely full that I still need to use. And then I'm going to go out and buy a new moisturizer. But I want to use this up while we're on the trip. So this is the moisturizer that I'm taking. Then I have a hand sanitizer. I use hand sanitizer every day before I apply my makeup because it's just gross. Bacteria and makeup are just disgusting. You don't want that. So um, I'm not taking a Bath and Body Works one. I have a ton of those. If I sh if you if I if you if you watch my last like haul video, my birthday haul, but um, I'm taking an Avon one because I want to get rid of it. It's an Avon Naturals and Cucumber Melon. It just looks like this. And then I have my two liners. I decided just in case I wanted a fun color, I brought a fun color as well. But I have my basic black liner, which is from Rimmel London. It's just a basic black. It's got a little smudger at the end in case I want to... Whoa. There we go. In case I want to smudge out my liner. I did not know that entire thing popped off. That's weird. And then I'm also taking the fun color liner, which is a NYX liner in Sapphire. It's pretty much gone, but it's a navy blue. It's really, really pretty. Then... I'm taking my mascara. I decided to take the one from my glam bag because um, it's really small. It's travel size and I really liked it. It's the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara. I love this. I tried it yesterday and I really, really like it. But um, it's really expensive. I looked up how expensive it was and I was like, maybe I'll just use the sample. But this is what the uh, wand looks like and I can't wait to use this every day while we're there. And then also from the My Glam bag, I'm bringing my Urban Decay Primer Potion because it's really small. Again, it's very convenient. And oh, and the last thing that I'm bringing that's also from the My Glam bag is the Urban Decay Eyeshadow in Sin because I tried this and I love it. I've been wearing it every day. have it on right now. And it's just a nice pinky champagne color. Very, very pretty. Um, as well as eyeshadows, I'm also bringing my NYX eyeshadow palette in Champagne and Caviar, which is the neutrals, because I use the brown to do my brows, and then just all the other colors I just mix and match every day. I have my face primer, which is the L'Oreal Magic Perfecting Base. It's like a mousse consistency, but it goes into a powder. Look how much I've used of that. It's so crazy. I use that every day. It makes sure my foundation and my face products don't really slip off my face, and I really need that. Um, the two powders that I brought, are, I'm bringing, are the Rimmel Stay Matte in Natural, which is my everyday face powder. As you can see, I've hit pan. And then also my bronzer, which is the NYC Smooth Skin Bronzing Face Powder in Sunny, which is just a bronzer. Because I'm pale. Then for a highlight, I'm taking the Hard Candy Blush Crush Baked Blush in Pin Up, which is a really nice pinky goldeny shade. I love this as an everyday highlight, and I feel like it'll make my cheeks look beautiful for all the princes that want to, you know, kiss me and stuff, you know? I wish. In my dreams. Um, then I have my clear mascara, which I use to set my brows every day. This is just like a random clear mascara I found in the aisle. It's a CoverGirl Professional mascara. Um, it's just in clear, and it's really dirty and gross because I've used a bunch of it. Just like that. And then I also have my liquid liner that I use on my top lashes every day, which is the L'Oreal Carbon Black Linear Intense, which just looks like this. I need a new one because it's getting icky. 
you. And then the last thing I'm bringing is my only lip product, which is a NYX round lipstick that I'm going to wear every single day. It's in the color Sash, which is a really nice frosty pink color. And really cool thing about NYX lipsticks, which I did not know until I watched Chao Bella XO's video, is at the bottom. Pops off. And you can touch it. Like, it's not weird. I went into Ulta the other day and just touched all of them, like popped them all off and yeah, I'm weird. So yeah, that's everything that I'm bringing. I hope you guys have a wonderful Christmas break so far, and I know I probably am having a wonderful time right now in Disney. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to go. Subscribe if you're not already, and yeah, bye guys.